I, I suggested some medicine I used for Margaret's case to Peter. But he, he's not sure whether you take it. What kind of medicine is it? Oh, Sam, you know this uh, preparation. Is it Dupa? Uh, exactly! Uh, well, I'm prepared to take any medicine now in order to get rid of this thing. Rather than let my parents know of it, for not my father. But unfortunately, uh, it is it is in my room. It's not here. So you can't let me have it? Uh, all right, if you like. I, I shall rush down and get it for you. Please. Okay. Uh, excuse me, go ahead. I, I shall not be long. Uh, Dora! Would you like to take this medicine now? Yes, but why do you ask? Oh, nothing. Only I have little trust in such preparations. Well, there's no harm in trying. If this fails, I shall risk them for anything. Oh, such as? The last resort, abortion by instrument. No! Dora! If this fails, come what may, I shall face any consequences that comes, if anything at all, not that kind of abortion. After all, the father will not kill us, and the worst he can do is better than this action. Peter, why have you changed your mind so suddenly? It was you who put the idea of forcing abortion that way into my head. It was you. And when you have almost changed or got me into it, you have suddenly changed your mind. What would you have done if I had objected to it at first? Wouldn't I have gone in for it? Mm, yes, but upon a second thought, I feel it is too risky eh? and may do more harm than good. Well, let us hope where this medicine works as he says. Well, let's hope so. Uh, Dora, does your father know where you've gone to? Now? I don't think you'll be pleased to know. What about your mother? She doesn't either. Why do you ask? Oh, nothing. Only maybe they may want you to do some housework. <laughs> Me? At this age and standard? Oh. Don't talk as if you were a princess. Hey, do you want to tell me? Your parents have not been letting you do anything. Since you went to college? Oh, not that. But at least, when I'm not there, they don't try to look for me. Yeah! I have bought it! Mm. It's a small thing, but it works wonders! Let me see. Ah! It's very bitter. 
Dora, you are brave enough. You know? So that my Peter may be saved from humiliation and disgrace. And so that Dora may be saved from a father's unpleasantness. Yeah. Well, my students are making things difficult for me. Why? You see, I taught this topic eh, to the best of my abilities. But a few didn't seem to understand. I just don't know what to do. Oh, repeat it. Eh? Don't worry yourself. Is that so? Repeat it. That's what I've been doing. <laughs> All right. I shall repeat it. Uh, eh? Dora, do you feel anything? Ready? It's working like hell. <laughs> well, let us hope so. Hmm, Peter, I feel some pains in my stomach. Ah. Hey, don't be excited, Peter. It will soon be all right. Girl, are you all right? It is getting worse. My stomach is getting too much. Hey, what kind of medicine is this? Ah. Well, it, huh? Is that how the medicine works? Because I am, I am, I don't seem to know much about such herbs. Uh, actually, I'm getting a bit worried myself. Uh, usually, it gives a little pain at first. But I don't know why it gives Dora so much pain. Ah, maybe you did not mix it right. Eh? Don't you think so? No, no. It is already mixed. So it needs no mixing again. Ah, uh, then why? Oh, please help me, my stomach. Ah! What is this I'm about to encounter? I don't know why it is happening like this. It's the same thing I gave to Maggie. Huh? Oh, Peter, won't you help me? Your friend has killed me. Why do you have killed me? Ah! Ah, Dora! Ah. I have killed you indeed. Ah. Yes, you have. Is this my reward for trying to help you? I said you have killed her. Peter, don't kill body alone. I have desire to drink it. Ah. Wedding, are you sure you mixed the medicine right? Eh? Ah. Should it anything not be added? Or is it the correct one? Ah. Ah. That is what I'm thinking about. You see, I have two kinds of that. But I'm not sure if this is the correct one. But it should be, because I kept it in this same handkerchief. Wally, huh? look at her eyes! Oh, white! Peter, how are you? Hi, sister! Ah. Hey! Dora! 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 Me today. Ah, I've killed her. I've killed Dora. But I am responsible. What is, what is to be done? We have committed murder. And if we are caught, we shall be in a very bitter position. You do the nature of Dora's father. Buddy, what shall we do? I have killed her. And what shall we do? Uh, uh, Peter, I, I have wronged you before. Oh, what do you mean? Uh, I, I have now remembered my great mistake. I, I picked the wrong one. What? But I hesitated. 
upon her own insistence. Peter, uh, uh, forgive me. Uh, I, I forgot it. Uh, even if we are caught, let, let us still be caught as friends. For it was my mistake. It was a great mistake. Oh! Dora! Could such a thing have happened if we were brave enough to expose it? Peter, the earlier we take a decision, the better. Eh? If anybody hears of it, that will be our end. Uh, yes, but look at her. Look at how she lies there. So fresh and young. But she is very cold. Eh? Even now, she doesn't seem like dead. Peter, the earlier we take a decision, the better. Uh, eh? uh, uh, if anybody hears of it, you will know the consequence. Uh, 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 yes, true, true. Uh, what do you say we must do? Uh, we must hide her in here until an opportune time for us to bury her secretly. Hey, that means we cannot come here regularly then. Uh, well, that would be the case if we take this step. But the old man in this house, don't you think if we do not come here for a day or two, he will suspect something? Who? Well, what shall we do then? Eh? It is dangerous leaving her here like this. Anybody could pick in. Uh, come, let us leave her. Peter, what, what is that noise? I think someone is coming. Lock the door. The door? Eh? Ah, but nobody is coming. Eh? Where do you say we must put her? Just let's lay her on the bed and cover her. Ah, on the bed? Ah. Once we, 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 we shut the door and lock it, we are safe. All right, all right, all right. You must now leave the room and be on the lookout for opportunity. Oh, yeah. Oh, what a misfortune. Look at her. A training college student. Poor girl. Her parents do not know what has happened to her. Peter, let this be the last words about Dora. We don't know where she is, neither have we seen her today. If anybody hears of it, we are trapped. Trapped? Mm. Should it not be better if I die with her now? What do you mean? Eh? Don't talk nonsense, Peter. Eh? And now, there she lies. Still, the dreams of two teachers, Buwedi and Peter Fari. Just look at her. You make me regret for having been your friend. Don't talk what? After killing her, you stand there and talk of regretting to be my friend. Hey, tell me now, which matters more, our friendship or the girl's death? Eh? Haven't you any feeling at all? Eh? And if you know how loving and good she was to me, you would tell me to depart this life now. Yes, you would. Peter, tell me what exactly you mean to say. Eh? What I mean to say. And why do you also want to ask me what I mean to say? Mm. I want to ask you what is behind your mind about me. Nothing. Wedding. Nothing is behind, is behind my mind about you. But when I glance through the past, only a few minutes ago, when she was here, fresh and sound, and now, she lies dead under the foolish ashes of my own hands and her friends. It makes me mad. It breaks my heart. As she was about to drink the fatal liquor, if I die, 
you will be held responsible. She said this was herself, not to me, but to you, Bwedi. Peter, take your decision now. Uh, what is on your mind? Eh? For I accept the fact that I killed Dora. What do you have in mind, Peter? We cannot bring Dora back to life. And we must take the disgrace. But I am responsible. Had it not been my action, the carelessness in my love affairs, nothing like this would have happened. The worst is here, and we must take it. I'm glad you speak like that now. Eh? Let, let's leave the room at once before the old man comes in. Eh? Oh, don't worry about that old man. Hey, if he utters a word on this, he and I will die that very instant. However, let us leave Dora in here. And if we're weak, we haven't got an opportunity to bury her secretly. Mm. She will continue to be here in Peter's room. Uh, good. Good. Uh, let me remove the glass. Uh, uh, break it. Uh, no. Uh, yes. But not in this room. Uh, let's go out, right? Awo, uh, Awo, my soup is finished. Your soup? Yes. this morning. Hmm. Well, we will take it like that. The rains. The rains. The rains are damaging our crops too much this year. Mm. 
Yet, where would I get the strength to visit them? I shall try and visit the farms tomorrow if things are all right. If by tomorrow my things are finished, I shall go with you to see if I can get some condomer and cassava. Mm -mm. Oh, it is teacher. <laughs> it is not quite some time when we are asking of your absence in the house. Oh, Nana, you need to have worry. Uh, I just traveled to see my uncle about some problems in the family. Oh, I see. But at least you could have informed us. Hmm? I am sorry, Nana. Nothing bad, I suppose. Well, only one serious incident. But you, well, why are you standing like beggars? Get yourself seats. Uh, we are just taking something and returning now. Uh, <coughs> but mm. you were telling me something. Yes. Uh, that girl who has been coming here, uh, I mean, as any daughter, the one in the college or whatever you call it, got missing since last three days. Uh, uh, who? Dora. Her father's eyes are as red as fire. He has been traveling to Sikaku, where there is a police station, every now and then, to report to the police there. Search parties have gone into all parts of the forest, but no trace of her. Hmm. What an unfortunate thing. Mm. Uh, uh, you see, that very day, uh, before I left here, uh, uh, she was here. Uh, uh, I mean, in this town. I even saw her coming to you, I think. <laughs> but, you see, nowadays, young girls are so saucy that if I had opened my mouth to ask, or even say good morning, I would have received the most unpleasant reply. So I kept my mouth shut. <clears throat> ah, 